I went to the American Academy of Dramatic Arts. That was a two-year acting program in LA. I also went to ACT in San Francisco. I met my first agent, my first voiceover agent, um, at something called Industry Week when we graduated. I thought I had no shot. No, I had no demo. I couldn't do accents. I think the, the what it came down to was formal acting training. You kind of learn everything. Right? So you learn a little bit of Shakespeare, you learn all the different dramas, and you learn how to stand, um, how to do Commedia dell'arte. After the end of all that, you have to decide what is it that I really bring. At the time, I didn't think it was voiceover. And I had to meet with my agency or my future agency to have them tell me that this is the right path for me. We ended up booking a Disney Channel show. It was the first time I was able to see myself, my, hear myself with an all-star cast on TV. I couldn't believe it. That was a wonderful call to make to my mom. There were a lot of ebbs and flows. It's not like you book something and then life happens, right? It's there to show you what's available, but you gotta work and you gotta be patient and work on your craft. I was introduced to Voices.com uh, through a friend who had just moved to Los Angeles. She was putting on uh, like a workshop just with voiceover friends and I showed up, met her for the first time and she was also a Voices.com member. I was very skeptical. I was resistant and you know what, and, and her, her talent was inspiring and I was like, if she's on there, I could be on there. You know, it took me 10 days to land my first job and it was just a voicemail but it well you know what i'll never forget it <laughs> it's not my biggest project but that one was the opening for me i was able to be a part of a show for three years we were nominated for uh, a new york emmy two years ago and we won this year i got that through voices you know i get to be a part of a part, of, a part of people's dreams come true. One of my most rewarding projects was this year. It was actually a couple months ago, three months ago. And it was for a Marvel animation feature film length. That was a dream for me. It was a star-studded cast. I got to hear the best of the best. I was, I had the honor to be in the same room. I wouldn't be there if I didn't put in all the daily work, you know, and, and Voices allows me to do that. Working on an online platform has given me freedom. My sister just bought a house and I was able to be with her and help her move and decorate and pick paint. I brought my setup. I made my little makeshift voiceover booth. I was able to have the money come in. I was able to be there for my family for a week. I think sometimes I take it for granted. Sometimes. I forget that that's not normal. <laughs> it's kind of like from other people that I'm getting the uh, feedback that this is pretty special. Voices.com has been a very good fit for me. Autonomy is so important to me. Being able to design my day and my life and where I'm going, that's so important to me. My repeat clients are about half of my business. So, um, you know, some of them I've worked with four, five, six years. They're invaluable, and a lot of them I met through Voices.com. The first thing that comes to mind is how nice everyone is at Voices. I enjoy talking to you guys. The account managers, I don't know how you attract such cool people. I don't know if it's just a Canadian thing, but I have really enjoyed speaking to the people that get me work. They work hard, they work hard, certainly harder than I do. And that's inspiring. It's just great. I, I really don't think I've ever come across a company that has attracted such good people. After my training at school, um, at the conservatories, um, I really didn't know what what I had to bring to the industry. Like most artists, you know, your family really worries about you. And um, my family was no different. And, you know, my mom visited me and 
it, it was just really nice to have her see, like to come over to my house and to be able to see that the training that I put in, the time that I put in, the, the dreams that I had as a teenager and the reason why I put in just years of my life to train for this, that, that, I mean, not that I knew it was going to work out, but, but that it really worked out. And to hear that from her mouth, it just meant so much to me. I'll just never forget it. And Voices.com was a huge part of that. <laughs>